I'm Dob the half-orc bard, struggling to find something that defines my character. But I guess it's my <laughs> pure heart. <laughs> and I suppose if pushed, I would probably go on to list qualities like my yearning smell. for adventure, my do or die smell. attitude, things like that. The smell, smell as well is, is a big thing. First, I think. Yeah. All the uh, noses in the world. All the yeah, ears so, in the world. So so many toes. Toes like you wouldn't <laughs> believe. You need toes? I've got them. <laughs> Speaking of which, your toes, um, which I'm pleased to tell you are still attached to your feet. Oh, thank yes. Um, thank you. So worried. It's always uh, a given. Not always a given. I say nothing, but I'd like to cast message to Merylwen if that's all right, and just be like, beep, 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 beep. Come in, Merylwen. <laughs> hey. Macarena. <laughs> yeah, sorry, it was an instinct. I'm, I mean, I'm dead. Okay, uh, you're sure you you aren't? Because like I, again, I check I myself. Can I can I check myself to check I'm not a kobold? Yeah, just make me a, a wisdom perception check. Okay. You see this child? Yeah. yeah. Yes. That's two One kobold, kobold in a coat. coat. No, it's two. Oh, okay. Oh. What about oh, that see, small see that? thing in see a coat? Cat? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Is that? Oh, that's that's just a cat. But the oh, owner is a cat. Okay. <laughs> I was going to say that would be impressive. And he's like, yeah, Wait, I Can I get a mulled wine, by the way, from the bartender, mm. the barkeep? Oh, it's definitely mulled wine. Mulled nice. yeah. wine all around, please. I'm yeah. coming! Hurry then. <laughs> <laughs> I demand mulled wine. Um, <laughs> and, and, and do you have mini marshmallows? The mulled wine? wine? Egg butt? Yes. What the hell is what? wrong with you? Oh. Room frost made, you of can't course take egg we have. Anywhere. Okay. Someone told Egbert some that mini marshmallows in mulled wine is very sophisticated. Yeah, it is. It's <laughs> cultured. New plan. Two birds, one stone. He tips a whole thing of marshmallows into the barrel. He's like, fill your pockets. Let's <laughs> it's going to blow. He's getting he's getting pretty rowdy himself. He's like, let's find kobolds. And you hear Jacob Ooh, from the back. Yeah. No kobolds! We're kobolds, taking these like, yeah. Merlot Mallows to some kobolds and... Yes! A... Merlot Mallows! He's already got the brand name in! Yes! <laughs> We're going to go to these wine-infused marshmallows. Marshmallows. <laughs> marshmallows! Marshmallow is of course, better. Uh, of course, of course, that's and... it. Are you all one? You all one? Y yes, yeah. All one. We are all one. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, don't set Dob up. He shoots that's a dirty me. look at Dob. Sorry, what, sorry, what's this? We... The... I was picking up. Well, I'm just signing us up for something. It's fine. You guys have been sort of unfair. Amazon, we do fighting. Where's yeah. the lie? We do fighting. We I'm not do getting do any fighting. trousers out of this. I'm not fighting for Egbert's trousers. You can share them. You can have them on the odd days of the month, and I can have them on the even days. Trousers I would share. recommend on those days, Corazon, that you wash them. <laughs> you protect Snicket today. What, what? Who or what is Snicket? Or when is Snicket? Snicket. Why is Snicket? When is Why Snicket? Is... <laughs> now! How is Snicket? How? Yes. Oh, thanks for ask. Um... Ah, this is Snicket. <gasps> there right. it. Snicket! Snicket! Snicket. 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 Racket. Uh, there are sort of a, a, just under 30, you reckon? Some are okay. milling around buying so things. Plenty to some spare are... is what you're saying. I, I, would like, <laughs> I, I would like to start rubbing olive oil into Egbert's haunches. Ideally, we would have started this 18 this again. four hours ago. I corral oh, gonna, the remaining gonna... kobolds. Yeah, let's corral them into a, a manageable area where we can see them yeah. all for and sure. And then, who wants starters. to hear some pirate stories? You, it's, again, it is very difficult to see in the blizzard, but you have a feeling that approximately somewhere between 10 and 15 of the kobolds have stripped off their coats and started to rub the snow so that they're their blood cools down and they go into hiber uh, hibernative, hibernative state. Hibernative state. They hibernate. Going into they a hibernative cold. state, huh? Yeah, I had to do that. Yeah. Oh, crap. One of my adventures. There I was um, on the island. <laughs> eight more of them do it. All of these kobolds are desperately <laughs> trying to knock themselves out by lowering, dangerously lowering their body temperatures. Dangerously lowering your body temperature, huh? That's what happened when I was swallowed by the Kraken. Yeah, it was a real time that it happened. Uh, well, uh, first I'd like to uh, win their trust by also trying to hibernate by shedding my warm clothes and rubbing snow on them. Oh, Dob! Um, okay. And as I do that, I would like to address the kobolds. Um, <laughs> as, say, as he like, undresses and, and say, rubs snow all over yeah, his body. Ah, like, oh, kobolds, yeah. Ah. Oh. Since Christmas until I've seen the first zombie of the season. <laughs> <laughs> the first zombie. <laughs> 
Mm. You've got to have something for zombies there, Paladin Egbert. I'm looking at you, Paladin Egbert, please. <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh yeah. I mean, something about the undeads, I don't know, maybe. Um, they're kind of just... So, you know how you kind of had your kobold um, sort of corral slash mm -hmm. naked sleeping pile? Um, they've just circled well, it. You say it like that, it sounds weird, Johnny. I know. <laughs> what would the damage on an icicle be? They're big and sharp. They're they pointy as heck. Sharp. So pointy. Let's call mm. it 2d8. Yeah, my sharp pointy boys. <laughs> <laughs> Do my bidding. <laughs> I am the Ice Queen. <laughs> I hope. It it tries to scratch you. Um, it does 1d6 minus 1 piercing damage. I rolled a 1, so ah. it sort of gently caresses your cheek. <laughs> oh, oh, that's worse sort of, somehow. Sort of that's gives so a yeah. gives a caress to your arm. It is creepy, and it's like <sighs> as it does it. I was thinking, no, that's bring the bridge down is a bad idea. <laughs> yeah. I was thinking Ooh. just bring like the mouth of it down, if that makes sense. Like so that you know, so that we're sort of trapped in, but they're on the, all the zombies. But that's <laughs> okay. Yeah. You know what? <sighs> That'll do it. Um, <laughs> So, Dob kind of um, gets out 50 foot of hemp and rope and <laughs> whips up a quick lasso. Um, and it's weird. He, he sort of makes it to the edge of the circle and then he starts running around the circle very quickly. Um, he's kind of speeding through the snow. He's a, uh, a snow speeder, you might call him. Um, and as he throws his lasso at one of the, the walkers, the zombies, sorry, um, mm. He starts to, yeah, just run around and try and tap all of their legs. Um, uh, at one point, uh, you hear Icewind Dale be like, Dude, no, stop, it's too dangerous! Um, you hear Dob mutter to himself, One more pass! <laughs> and then, uh, wow. What's your armor class again, Corazon? Um, 15. I am hidden. Oh, you're hidden. Sorry, not Corazon then. Uh, let's say Meryl Where's went. Where's Corazon? <laughs> Mine is also 15. Yeah. Okay. When we needed look. him most. <laughs> I shoot a look in the general direction where I think Corazon is. Like, Corazon's yeah. hat is poking up. Um, the... right. So they're actually looking at each other and being like, isn't this great? <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, oh. Meryl Wen. I'm basically sober again. The, the... <laughs> Basically sober. Yeah. Actually, Basically... better when he's drunk. So, <laughs> all right. So, please don't let the shot be in vain. And when I say that, I mean literally in, in the vein. Way. In my neck. <laughs> I punt Merylwen into the hot spring. <laughs> Single hobnail boot to the okay. Area. Yeah, yeah. I, this is Sparta Merylwen into spring. If it's I love it. I absolutely love it. I trust your prudence. <laughs> As prudence just like, like throws her hips forward and just canes Meryl when with her, hobnail boots. With her hobnail boots. And it's good. <laughs> yeah, it's like, good. <laughs> You've just invented bath bombs, but they're oh. horrible. Oh no. <laughs> patent pending, patent pending. Bath bombs. I think of the bath two business ideas. Probably let's go with marshmallows. Yeah. Yeah. No, I, I refuse. That can be our backup. Yeah, backup on Dragon's Den. I throw I some uh, citrus fruits at him. Ah! Make oh, him. No, yes, no, Meryl Wynn, no. Oh. No, but, but where did you? Where did you get? Where did you get the lemons from? Yeah. I always have them just in case. Oh, good. Okay. Fine. Someone, no, presumably. no further questions. Right. Yeah. <laughs> good. Meryl Wynn, you turn into a kobold, then you die, then you become a zombie kobold. <laughs> that's just, that's what you are now. You're Meryl when there's <laughs> no, I'm joking. You can be you can be we'll uh, every day. You can be a wood elf druid until the end of the session, and then we'll talk. Um, well, no. Um, I, <laughs> yes, this young vampire that I've been educating. <laughs> Tell me more about the amorous young vampire. <laughs> Old necro boy over here. He's mm. his name is his name is Vlad, and he needs to work on his lines. Mm. Oh, maybe. Why is that a mirror in your pocket? I can't see myself. I am a vampire. <laughs> That's good. It's working on you. I've been to it. I'm very yeah. glad to have met him. Oh God. 
uh, Vlad, uh, Vlad turns into a bat, flies among the uh, others, uh, goes above the clouds, get caught, caught in a blaze of sun, and dies. He just he burns see? to death. That's <laughs> you when you see what happens. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Yeah. I assume in. you're going to smash through a window. I'm going to smash through the window on a rope, and then maybe if there's a chandelier, swing on it. If not, I'll improvise. All right. You're, just... You're not breaching and clearing without a flashbang. Yep. A holy okay. flashbang. <laughs> a little yeah. thing I've been working on is hope it goes yeah. well. Okay. Um, yeah, I'll use my crossbow to fire the flashbang. You've, you've twisted my arm. After three years, I will <laughs> use that weapon you it. created for me. <laughs> <laughs> it is every bit as cinematic as you hoped it might be. Yes! Um, uh, Dub does like a, a sort of three point superhero landing in the fireplace. Um, Lots of uh, like embers fly up in a cool particle physics sort of way as he is lit. Beautiful object source lighting. Um, like his, the sound of him landing coincides with the crash of the door, which flies perfectly like upright across the entire room, <laughs> splinters against the bar. It is followed by a flashbang <laughs> that sails over the bar and then <laughs> in an incredible flash of light, um, it kind of there goes be someone up. in here. <laughs> it's light. There's a lot of patrons trying to have a quiet Who drink. knows? <laughs> this, <laughs> this light uh, sparkles majestically off the fragments of glass that have just been kicked into the room by uh, Corazon, billowing behind him, holding onto a rope that's wrapped around the forearm. Uh, the other hand's just in slow motion, just sweeping through his hair. <laughs> and, um, <laughs> Meryl, when uh, just without looking at any of this, just kind of opens the door and uh, throws it wide and just just walks into the tavern, um, kind of like bits of door, bits of glass, bits of like flaming ember just swirling around her. Um, <laughs> and uh, Dana, who is standing at the bar cleaning a mug, looks up and goes, What? <laughs> And then what? You tackle an elderly lady to the ground. Yeah. <laughs> this is what you get for Just making like, zombies, as I expect. Does, I've invented a, a brand new drink. Yeah, it's, I bet you have. It's called a, a Riaka Mellow. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> no, quick. She must be stopped. That's it. going to steal our idea. You, you're not supposed to. It's staff only. <laughs> oh, she's got us there. All right, well, I leave. Uh, <laughs> yeah, all right, right. We untie Dana. Go. Yeah, <laughs> get out of my tavern. We leave quietly. Damn, we were so close. <laughs> You're a nasty uh, piece of work, Dana, and I respect yeah. that, but we're going to have to crush you. <laughs> I mean, literally. No. Hang on. I've got, a, I've got a plan. How about we put her in the cellar and I just, you know, seal it up? You, be, you really want to build hey, a door, whoa, whoa, don't whoa. you? Desperate Dang, to build a door. Dang, Wow. I, oh, I love I it. This... That's brutal. 